Bull and today we are not talking about Marvel or DC or anything we are talking about the TV show that has been going strong since 2010 I'm talking about of course The Walking Dead now this show is currently in its ninth season and has been renewed for a tenth season and started in 2010 as I've always stated it's became such a success that it's had spin-offs video games which I highly recommend you play the Telltale series because it's brilliant and you'll just love it if you love the show or comics and what I like about the show it also diverges differently from the comics it doesn't follow it straight away but today we're talking about a tiny episode that was announced that was planned back in season two when Frank Dubon who was the original showrunner and directed the pilot had planned although it looks like now it won't happen since Frank Dubon has been let go by MC but who knows we may get it I want to tell you about this episode from the actor who's going to play the main character Sam Whitwer and hope that and you will give me your opinion would you like to have seen this episode would you not like to have seen it or who knows maybe this could be a future film in the in the future who knows but before we start make sure you subscribe to the channel like the video comment on what else you'd like to see and also go and like my facebook page to be kept up to date on what i've got planned for this channel thank you and now let's get started get the general idea of where this lost episode as i'm going to be calling it in this video came from we have to go all the way back down to 2010 back to the pilot of the walking dead now the walking dead follows the comics closely although in later seasons they've changed it with characters dying in different ways certain things which i like i think it's a very good idea and how it all goes i may do a few a video in the future about the differences but anyway in that episode rick grimes goes to a lander to find his family comes across a horde of zombies to escape them he would have crawled into he crawled into a tank and came across a soldier who then woke up turned into a zombie and Rick would have shot him and took the grenade out of his hand and at the end of the season that grenade sort of helps save his and his group's life now that zombie is played by actor Sam Witwer who might be more known to Star Wars fans as he voices many characters in that media he voices Starkiller in the Force Unleashed video games he played Darth Maul in the Han Solo film and is currently seen in Supergirl as Senator of Liberty Anyway, in an interview with Paranormal Pop Culture, Sam Whitwer said to the journalist that Frank Dumont, who was the showrunner at the time and was let go halfway during season two, that there was an episode plan showing that his character, starting at the beginning of the apocalypse as a soldier and watching as civilization falls during the apocalypse, the chain of command breaks down, everything goes to hell basically, and Sam Whitworth's character would have ended up shooting his command. He says it was like the Twilight Zone episode with zombies. Which I think would have sound cool. But at the end, Sam Whitworth's character was going to be bitten by a zombie and crawl into a tank. And would have had a grenade ready in his hand to blow himself up so he didn't turn. But unfortunately, he died before he could do it. And then it would have cut to Rick Grimes' character from the pilot. Climbing into that same tank, finding Sam Whitworth's character with the grenade, shot him, and then it would have been done. And it would have been like an entire story of one guy who is not even related into the comics. Although the zombie tank scene is in the comics, it's not the full one. It's not like there was no story with the zombie, it was just there. But it was scrapped, AMC. Apparently EMC wanted to save a few books and it was totally forgotten. Frank Dumont was let go during season two. Now, I know that the Fear of the Walking Dead TV show is like a kind of is the spin-off on the Walking Dead showing you how showing you a different perspective of the song of the apocalypse. But I think it would have been cool to see this episode. I would love to have seen a soldier basically in this apocalypse showing him as a young soldier fighting for his country and then basically the apocalypse starts 
showing you how they survive, showing you the civilization fall, showing you everything going wrong, and showing you his journey to survive until he's untimely death by a zombie just biting him. Now, I know that it's, I know it's on the minute dead and buried, but excuse the pun, but it's, I love to have seen it like maybe they'll do it in a future series or maybe they'll do it in like a comic that Robert Kerman writes like because I mean Negan has an actual backstory in the comics yet again I might do a video on that later on so maybe they could do a comic special comic showing you this journey of how it all came to be but unfortunately looks like at the moment that's not gonna happen but you tell me down below, do you like to, this episode? Do you, would you have liked to have seen this kind of episode? Or would you have just thought, no, it doesn't sound good? Let me know in the comments section down below. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, people. That was about the lost episode of The Walking Dead. I hope you liked it. If you did, remember to click the like button down below. Comment on if you would have liked to have seen that episode. Maybe you wouldn't have liked to have seen the episode. Let me know down below. And let me know what else you would like to see on this channel. Also, if you haven't already, click the subscribe button and click the bell icon to be known up to date on when I'm going to be uploading a new video and when I'm going online. Because I'll be doing some live streams in a few weeks. Now, also, go to my Facebook page, The Macam Nerd, and go and click, give that a like. Thank you, and I'll see you later. Bye.